Employment has risen to 25.5%, that 0.3 percentage points up on the first quarter. What does that mean in numbers? In numbers, it means that over 5.1 million people are officially unemployed. Um, unemployment numbers rose by 87,000 on a quarter-on-quarter -quarter basis, that is from the first quarter to the second quarter. Um, discouraged job seekers rose by 64,000 people. Discouraged job seekers speaks to those people who have been seeking work in the, you know, formally, but then have now given up on looking for work. Uh, when you take that number into account, that takes the, um, that takes the, the um, unemployment rate to 35.6%, which is quite a significant number. Analysts say that number could be even higher, given the fact that this is official statistics. Um, there's a lot of people who are not captured in this sort of data. Um, the informal sector, sorry, in the formal sector, 24,000 jobs uh, were shared on a net-net basis, although the formal sector also created 39,000 jobs, but on a net net basis, once you've done your additions and deductions, um, 24,000 jobs were lost. Um, in the informal sector, 43,000 jobs were created, uh, creating some sort of balance there between the formal and the informal sector. On a year on year basis, positively, 380,000 jobs were created, but that's still nowhere near enough to reach government's targets of the new growth path uh, and the national development plan which uh, talk about 500,000 jobs needing to be created for us to get to some reasonable level of employment in the country. All right, Devin, it's back to you. Uh, thanks very much indeed. Nampu Molelo Saziba there uh, giving us uh, some feedback on the latest unemployment stats released by Stats SA. Well, Mike Schussler from economist.co.za joins me now to talk about those unemployment figures. Uh, Mike, good afternoon. Under